welcome back to another video. Today, guys, we're going to be looking at, uh, guys, my Christmas wish list. As you all know, guys, Christmas is only one, exactly one month away. So, guys, we're going to be making the Christmas wish list video to see, guys, what I'm going to be wanting for Christmas. And this may even give us some insight to my 2023 Monster Jam season. Alright, so, first off, our first category of stuff, which is Spin Master Monster Jam Trucks. Alright, so here's some stuff I want for Spin Master Monster Jam. We do have this pickup truck Avenger. This could be something Jim Kohler could bring out next year. Here, this more accurate pickup truck Avenger that he used in 2017. Maybe Jim Kohler wanted to bring that out for a show. Maybe at some point next year, we can we, we can try to get this so we can bring it out for net for a show next year. We have the Orange Grave Digger. Don't know who would who's gonna who would use that. More for a World Finals paint scheme, but I'm wondering which of the Gravedigger drivers would want to drive this for World Finals next year. If they make it in. Next we have Maximum Destruction. As you all know, 20, 20 years of Max D is next year, so... So I need to get one of these Maximum Destruction bodies. I'll need the body, I don't really want the chassis. Chassis can just be like a backup chassis for new trucks. But I could definitely use this body and make the 20th anniversary body out of it, since I can't make it out of a spiked body, because it's not the shape. So that'd be something cool and useful. The 30th anniversary grave digger. You'll have to see what that'll be used for next year. What I'd want that for. You have to see. And wait, wondering what we're gonna be using this for for next year. Showtime Earthshaker. You know, this would be something cool for Tristan England to drive out next year. We try to. We've been trying to get this for a while now, but we we have unfortunately not been able to get it. So we want the Showtime Earthshaker for Tristan England next year. A Chrome Grave Digger, probably something we're going to probably use for World Finals next year for somebody to drive, but we just don't know who. We'll just have to wait and see once the World Finals next year will get closer and closer. A Showtime Grave Digger, because guys, I don't, because guys, Grave Diggers are returning to the normal body next year, so I'm just mainly going to need the normal bodies here. I need one Showtime Grave Digger, a second one, a third one, a fourth one. I'm going to want a lot of Showtime Digger bodies, because the only Showtime Grave... I have two Showtime Grave Digger bodies currently, which I'll probably swap on Adam Anderson and Tyler Meninga chassis, but we're still going to need some for Kristen Anderson, and, uh, Kristen Anderson, Weston Anderson, and Brandon Vinson. And maybe just a Showtime Grave Digger, just to keep. I also want this front engine Max D, just so I, that way I don't have to destroy my red Max D that I have, so I can make the map my... 20th anniversary Max D body customed as a front engine chassis, and so I don't have to use the red Max D, D from the five pack. I can just use another one of these, and hopefully the body swap would work. Next up, we want a whiplash. It's gonna be be useful for axe next year to make a more accurate axe. Bad company. Now I'm gonna want four bad companies. I need one red, one for the regular bad company, another one for the Hardy body. Another one for the Wet Sounds body, and then another one for the Neon Orange body. I want, um, this Blue Thunder right here. I mean, it's a bit, a tiny bit more tour after, kind of, so. And like that, just in case the Blue Thunder competes next year or sometime in the future. And okay, now I want three true heavy metal tour locos, because I'm actually wanting the Team Scream trucks to run on these kind of chassis, because... It would be more tour accurate because the Team Scream trucks are a bit heavier than the normal trucks. Currently, I already have one for one of the four Team Scream trucks next year, which is, uh... We have one for, uh, Corey Rummel. That we, that we, that, um, he practiced on it, out of, on it today. But we need still one for Jim Kohler, Joe Foley, and Chris Kohler, so... So we're gonna need these three El Toro Locos for Excalibur... Um, for Team Tom Fleury Motorsports, who knows what we'll do with this? Is for now, and they're just gonna probably take it back to the shop uh, for um, Excalibur, or maybe even just uh, maybe we'll have it unveiled at World Finals next year. Who knows? Next up, I'm gonna want five of these Greater the Legends because these World Finals 18 Encores Greater the Legends because these have a more tour accurate Grave Digger chassis. It's a bit of a lighter green than what we've seen on previous Grave Diggers. So I'm gonna want one to keep. One for um, Adam Anderson, one for Tyler Meninga, one for Brandon Vinson, and one for Weston Anderson. Next, I want two Krakens for the green. You know, I want this green Kraken just to keep just one as a collectible. 
Then I want another Kraken to use it to make a, like, if Nick Pagliuto decides to debut a new Kraken next year at World Finals, then we'll use it, we'll use this, for, we'll, we'll use it for that. That's how you don't have to go through the process of trying to get all the blue Sharpie off the blue Kraken. Next, I want the Hall of Fame truck. This would be kind of like a useful display if for my Monster Jam World Finals. Just have it out there as a display somewhere for the pit party. We have the Blonde to the Bone Grave Digger. Who would want to drive this at World Finals next year, which could be something we could use at World Finals next year. I want the Raven in here for the Halloween truck. I mean, I've collected all of the Halloween trucks, so we're just going to want another one. Because... I want the, um, a Monster Mutt Dalmatian to make for Bailey Shea, to make it for Bailey Shea's kind of like a Monster Mutt Dalmatian, whether, what the chassis color will be, I'm pretty sure it's going to be black with the, uh, with black with maybe, um, maybe like, uh, like, tires like Vendetta has with the red bead light, bead lock in the black rims. So, I'd like another Monster Dalmatian for Bailey Shea, kind of a bit of a spoiler for, uh, next year. I mean, I want the Christmas truck from this year because, um, I could use another Christmas truck for, um, for, for holiday racing to add and expand onto my field. I want to try to get to 100 trucks for holiday racing one, one year, one day. I want the DC 5-packs. I collected all the other three 5-packs. I got the Loco one for my birthday this past year. I got the Max Z 5-pack, I believe, for Christmas in 2020, and then I think I just bought it, like, some random time of year when I bought the Gravedigger 5-pack. Harley Quinn? Hmm. I'm wondering what this could be for. Hmm. A Megalodon here from Michaela Tolochka, another kind of, like, spoiler for my thing. Thing, so, yeah, we're gonna, we just like to make it like that. I think, uh, the chassis from Michaela Tolochka next year is gonna be... Probably Megalodon with, um, green, with BKTs with, uh, blue beadlocks and silver rims, and then just having a great chassis. The Chrome 25th Anniversary Grave Digger, because, you know, we'll, you'll have to see what that'll be used, used for for next year, for next season. I, I know what it's going to be used for, I think you guys are going to like it. I want the Big Air World Finals play set. this is also going to be something, and you guys are, um... The World Finals Big Air Challenge. You're gonna have to see what this is gonna be used for. Used for. I can't reveal it yet, but it, it's gonna be used for something cool. The only thing you guys are gonna be liking for the next Monster Jam season. Alright, that's finished up our first category. Now we're gonna move on into Hot Wheels Monster Jam trucks. First off, I want the Small Hump Wild thing because, well, we kind of destroyed ours in Edmonton, if you can remember, where David Olfer broke the wheel after he saved it, but he broke the front wheel off and he didn't freestyle any further. And that truck has still not been fixed. I don't know if it's repairable. So I just want to buy one wild thing just to keep. Now on three of the big hub, uh, the big hub wild thing. Things, um, one of them I just want just to keep. I want another one for David Olford's Velociraptor. Because if I buy three of those, those would probably break of the small hub ones. Because of how fragile they are. But I think the big hub ones could, could be durable. So I want one for David Olford and then one for Travis Murray. I want Hulk. For the Marvel trucks coming back next year. Yeah, kind of more spoilers. The Grandma Grave Digger right here. Uh, I can't reveal what this is going to be used for yet, but you, I think you guys are going to like it. The Black Avenger, right, which came out in a 5-pack. Um, I think uh, Jim Kohler may want to run this again next year here for some show, but we but we still know yet. But this would be cool for Jim Kohler to come back and run. BKT, just for display since they... Since they they display an actual BKT truck out there, not just a ride truck, so... Oh, yeah, I want the old, um... BKT truck. It's kind of rare, though. It's from 2015. X-Ray Gunslinger, because... Yeah, I kind of destroyed my X-Ray Gunslinger, and I made it into a jail Jailbird for this year. Here, for Kalen Miguez. But I just kind of want another one, just to, like, have a collectible here of Gunslinger. I want this Gunslinger, because I think I, ha I had this Gunslinger before. I know I have the flag burp, but I don't know what happened to the truck. I don't know if it's customized or... I somehow lost it, so I just want another one of these gunslingers right here. Just for collection. Iron Man, because... I want a new Iron Man, because the one I currently have... I have two Iron Mans. I have the Snow Tire one, which is used for holiday racing, and then, then the, my old Iron Man. Now, my old Iron Man that I had was run... Leo Donald ran that chassis on my old Iron Man. He ran it from about 2011 all the way to 2014. Then we actually brought the Iron Man chassis back that I have, but painted the tires green 
and put tinfoil on it to make it into an alien invasion for 2016 and then the first quarter of 2017 with the tinfoil body. So for, for an Iron Man, I'd like to get one but to have repaired tires that are not painted green on the inside because I had to made in, cause I made to an alien invasion like in, in 2016. So yeah, um, this blue grain grave digger can't really reveal what that's going to be used for next year just yet. Red primer grave digger can't reveal what that's going to be used for yet next year either. Carolina Crusher, because uh, I want the trophy truck body back because I kind of did destroy mine to make Rockwell Red, so I'd like to have another one of those. Alright now guys, we're going to be entering kind of like our next category. The rest of the Hot Wheels Monster Jams slash Hot Wheels Monster Trucks I'm going to use are going to be used for holiday racing. First out we got Chill. We got chill. Actually, I need to bring up the um, Brian. I need to bring up the uh, website. Yeah, I need to chill out for next. And chill, chill out. I want the Mercury Monster in my body because I want to maybe in, in order to get to 100 trucks for holiday racing, I need to maybe start adding variations of other trucks, such as having both the new tool Monster Mutt and the Mercury Mutt. Looks like my speaker is dying. I would like to get the Monster Mo Rottweiler because I don't have that yet. Orange El Toro Loco. Because I had the red one, but I'd like to add another variation with the orange one. Uh, I'd, I'd like to have this Grave Digger, the new tool Grave Digger. I, I, ha I currently have three Grave Diggers in Holiday Racing. I have... The, uh, I have the regular old tool one that is currently that is being currently driven by Dennis Anderson for holiday racing. I have the track based tires Grave Digger, which is being used for the Flying Dutchman, and then Liam's Toy Time is in the Grave Digger Ice. So, oh yeah, and just add another variation for another Grave Digger and then add the new tool. Next up, Color Choice Ice Cream Man 